Dozens of people have been killed in an early morning earthquake in eastern Turkey. Video from our part partner network, CNN Turk, shows frightened residents in eastern Elazığ province out in the streets. Now that's some 625 kilometers east of Ankara, the country's capital. The U.S. Geological Survey says it measured 5.9 in magnitude. Authorities say that the quake was followed by several aftershocks, one as strong as 5.5 in magnitude. CNN's Ivan Watson's on the line now from Istanbul with more details of this developing story. Story, Ivan. Zane, this was an earthquake that struck before dawn. So while people were sleeping in this area, about 4:32 in the morning, according to Turkey's uh, National Earthquake Monitoring Center, the initial quake had a magnitude of 6.0. That we're hearing other numbers from the prime minister's office right now. Ambulances are rushing. Uh, search and rescue teams are rushing from other parts of southeastern Turkey to the earthquake zone, uh, ambulance helicopters being rushed to the area as well. And what it seems like what has happened, what has been most affected is uh, mud brick houses in this rural area in a mountainous region. They are the ones that appear to have come down according to eyewitnesses we've talked to on the ground and some of the rescue teams uh, moving and operating in that area. The more built up urban areas where you can ha often have five and six story apartment buildings made out of concrete and brick, uh, they don't seem to have been initially as impacted uh, at nearly as much. So, so there is a silver lining to this uh, disaster. But uh, the uh, Prime Minister's office says at least 100 people have been injured. Uh, by latest count, at least 41 people killed. And a big concern now, Zane, is going to be where are people who have lost their homes? Where are they going to find shelter right now? It is freezing cold. It is March right now in a mountainous area. The Turkish Red Crescent, we hear already, is rushing tents to the area. But as we see from pictures coming out of that uh, earthquake zone, uh, people out in the streets huddling around fires already uh, after this uh, terrifying earthquake. Also, Zane, uh, a number of aftershocks, at least 55, according to the Turkish prime minister's office, some of them quite powerful. So you can imagine how scary that must be for survivors of this earthquake. Zane? CNN's Ivan Watson reporting.